another presentation. That's the one he needed right there. Breath. Exhale. Sit down. Exhale. Imbalance. Perfect. All right, guys, Dr. Randy here again. <clears throat> Jake in the office. He's been so kind to let us do a video here for his full spine adjustment. He's a sophomore at Seton Hill, so doing a lot of studying, a lot of desk work, computer work. So it, that's not just students, college students, but students of all ages, even the younger ones. They're in school for seven, eight hours a day. You sh they sh these kids, I adjust my kids every week, I try to, or every other week. You should be bringing them in to get their spine checked, get their, ne get their neck adjusted. Their necks are down, reading books and doing homework all day long. Um, it puts a lot of stress on the upper neck. Our spines were never designed to do that kind of stuff all day. So you have to do it, it's part of school, it's part of the, whether, whether it's your job or school. You have to do it, but you should be trying to be as active as you can outside of work and school and be getting your spine adjusted because spinal movement is so important. All right, so it's so like you're, you get a headache or just a little yeah. bit. He's, getting, he's all over, so we're gonna give him a full spine adjustment. Okay, deep breath in, exhale. Perfect. He's a model patient. <laughs> There's a little drop drop work he had. I was doing some before the video started. He had a right PI ilium or a right extension restriction. So he has uh, his right leg goes short. He has a little extension restriction in his SI joint. It's very common to have some um, uh, misaligned or restricted SI movement. Your two hips move like this with your sacrum in the middle, so they can get stuck in extension or flexion. So we do a lot of drop work to help remove those restrictions and undo that pelvic, you know, imbalance, imbalance. Table sounds really loud, but it's very comfortable. And he's a little tighter on this side. So again, part of what we do in this office is we try to do a little soft tissue work on each patient. I know he has some neck and shoulder, that was his chief complaint, but he has a little bit of adhesion and tightness built up around his right SI. So we're just gonna do a little soft tissue work, strip down this right QL muscle and it's like almost in spasm all the way up his back. Which brings me to another point. He, his chief complaint when he came in was headaches, upper back pain, but I can feel it low back. So by getting adjusted and coming in to get checked, I'm able to, he's able to prevent maybe a bigger problem from happening in his low back and not waiting until something happens. The idea being you want to be preventative and you want to use maintenance, not just come in when you're in a ton of pain. I always use the analogy, people, you don't go to the dentist until you're, you don't wait till your tooth's falling out and decayed and rotten to go see a dentist. You go regularly. We should be treating our spines the same way. You okay? Yeah. All right, go on your side, face me. Deep breath, exhale. Side, very good. Deep breath. Exhale. Sit, my man. Face up. Okay, nice and easy here in the neck. Just relax your shoulder. Perfect. Same thing this way. He's a little more restricted going into his left rotation. That's the one he needed right there. Mid back. Slide down. Deep breath, exhale, breathe out, Jake. All right, go face down for me again. So we're gonna just finish with some soft tissue work in his shoulders. He, that was his full spine adjustment, he did very well. He adjusts really well. And so that should give him not just the back pain, discomfort, which was actually mild, but it should also help his neck, shoulder, mid back. You are tight through here, my man. You okay? Mm -hmm. We all hold a lot of tension in our shoulders, so slide down a little bit towards your feet. Let your arm relax here. Deep breath. Exhale. Good. Little one there. Same thing this way, Jake. Deep breath in again. Exhale. Good. Come on up. Do your shoulders.
Thanks.